Welcome to Seaview Holiday Resort. This is where your holiday begins. Ooh, that's a lot of luggage. First things first, let's check in fast and efficiently. Once our helpful staff has checked you in, it's time to party, yeah! Get those bodies on the dance floor and move those legs. you can always watch from the wheelchair area, up the stairs and opposite the dance floor. That's where the real fun happens. Shazam! Oh, that looks like fun. And after all those burned calories, you're going to be hungry. You can mm. enjoy our full or half board options. Yum, yum, or, yum, 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 yum. if you see yourself as a bit of a chef, you can self-cater. Las caravanas solo tienen microondas. Enjoy your stay at Sea View. This could be our last season, so book now before it's too late. It might not be Butlins, but it sure is better than Auschwitz. We are the media guys. We are the media guys. Media guys, bitches. Well, what do you think? Are we closing down? No, we're not closing down. You said we might be closing down. That's why you need a new promotional video. Well, yeah, but... But you're not supposed to put it on the video. So we are closing down, then? Yes, but that doesn't matter. Look, what we need to do is to focus on this video which needs to be sorted out. Sorry, the Auschwitz reference was because... Well, if you can't laugh about it now... No one laughs at Auschwitz. No, that, that's the point, isn't it? Why didn't you... We're laughing with... the people from Auschwitz. About what? Auschwitz. We're closing down. Typical. Working with clients, always changing their minds. I didn't change my mind. And I never asked for a Holocaust joke. You didn't not ask for a Holocaust joke. You have been racially insensitive to one of the biggest religious groups in the world. And what's worse, You've been telling people that we are closing down! The Auschwitz reference is surely the worst part of this video. Holocaust. It's the same thing. Oh, God, seriously. The, the point of the joke is... I was quite clear that we needed to make a promotional video to increase sales which hasn't been happening since we appeared on Whistleblowers. Tonight, on Whistleblowers, see you holiday camp. Shit on the walls, shit in the shower, shit in the bed. In fact, shit everywhere. This is a shit hole. I want my 550 back. Now, now, 
this isn't how you were meant to find out. But we all know the situation. We haven't got time to hire a new production team. So, you are going to have to go away and make a new version. And until we're satisfied, you're not getting paid. Paul, I totally understand where you're coming from, don't we? Mm -hmm. But I'm getting a lot of bad atmosphere from, especially you. Negativity. As you say, there's good bits and bad bits. I never said that. I'm pretty sure I heard one good bit. Never trust media students. I thought you said never trust bisexuals. No. I say you never trust blacks. And we learnt that the hard way. I was joking. Yeah. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> Why wouldn't you trust bisexuals? Well, look. They can't make up their own minds. How can we trust them? Mm -hmm. So why don't you trust blacks? Well, I don't, I don't really want to go into it, but let's just say that I had 12 Cadbury's cream eggs and when Demarcus Jackson left, there were only 10. Need I say more? Well, that proves nothing. Does it? Hmm? Oh, like you're to start command. Come in, start command. Hello? Hello? I'm late for a meeting. Well, I've got to go off and sort out those microwave ovens. Apparently, they've been banned since 1993. <laughs> Some sort of cancer. Okay, Jose, where are you? Jose, Jose! Don't be deaf, Spaniard, where are you? Well, that was awkward. What, the video or our manager being a racist? I do think the word racism is tossed around quite loosely these days. Oh, the only loose thing around here is you. Babes. I'm just slightly worried. I work with those media guys on my latest show reel. <laughs> what, Sean and Mike? I just wanted to give some enthusiastic students a chance. But now I'm worried that it might turn out a bit... Shit. Wank. OK, well, let's not get carried away. You haven't seen it yet. At least it was better than last year's promotional video. <laughs> that you work with those guys. I'm just trying to get my name out there. Like Shane. He's to us holiday entertainers what Queen wants to gaze. I knew one of Queen was gay. Well, you try telling them that. All I want to be is a Pontins blue coat. Honestly, it's like me and Shane share the same DNA. You're never going to make it to the same level as Shane working with those guys. I mean, did you see the way they were looking at you? I really know this. Probably heard about you. I don't know where I get this reputation from. Uh, probably from sleeping with everyone who comes through the gates. <laughs> that is not true. I didn't even finish off that fat Welshman that was here last season. Oh, Tracy. Oh, it's all right. His wife did. Wayne? Yeah? Sorry to interrupt, but there's been another complaint about Savile's Garden. Bloody hell. It seemed like such a good idea at the time. Two little boys had two little boys. <laughs> oh, these boys. kids don't know how lucky they are. Yeah, let's get them all in so Jim can have a play with them. Yeah. Jimmy, come in. Come on, fix it for us, lad. <laughs> we really have to change that name. I know. Oh, it's just brilliant to watch. Really good. And the, the, the book, which you're calling a meranual. 
a Miranio to see what I've done. Yeah, yeah. 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 What? Well, um, you there? It, when, it's when you Call some air, where else am I going to be? What are you up to? The usual, nothing, why? Well, since we're alone, I thought we might take advantage of this time and spend it together. Really? Just you and me, no one else? Yeah. So, I've got something for us to watch. Wayne, what have I told you about borrowing porn from Paul? It's not porn. He won't lend me any more after the state I sent the last one back in. What is it? The next step in our lives. My new showreel, courtesy of those media guys. Oh, Wayne. I can't wait to send this off to Pontins. They'll be begging for me to work from when they see this. I knew it was too good to be true. I knew it. It's like living with Rayman, living with you in this house. It's not a house, is it? It's a caravan. And a shit caravan at that. Hey, we could do a lot worse than this for 5 50 a month. But just you wait. This time next year, we'll be relaxing on a sunny beach in Southport. Cocktails in hands. This is the stuff that dreams are made of. You said we'd be alone. Well, it's not just our home, is it? You said we'd only be here six months. Two years in this bastard place, and now we've got to live with those twats for the season. And then to top it off, I've got to sit through this shit. How could I have even thought there might have been a smidgen of romance in you? Why are you always bringing me down? Can't you just watch it, woman? Give it a chance. Wayne, I need more than this in my life. I feel like Elizabeth Britzel trapped in here. Ow, they had sex. <gasps> oh, I suppose two didn't want it either. Well, let's get it on. All right, show up and get it on. Might as well witness this shit before I hear about it from someone else. Jose, where have you been? Out for a morning stroll around the site. Sarah was looking for you. No way. I will be the next president of the United States of America. Why? 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 Pause. 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 Show. 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 Real. 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 I'm Wayne Paulus, and that was my show reel. Oh, that's great, Wayne. Well done. Thanks, Jess. I thought so too. You haven't half done some crap in your time. And this coming from the woman whose favourite show is Miranda. I don't know why I bother showing you these things. You're always bringing me down. I'm only doing this to make you happy. Well, at the moment, Wayne, I'm not happy. There comes a time in everyone's life when you have to stop chasing your dreams and wake up to reality. I'm not listening to this. I'm going to rehearsals. Wayne, you need to man up. Grow a pair. You wouldn't know if I had a pair. Wayne. Fuck off. Can you believe she told me to man up? Me? Wayne, pause. Yeah, shocking, that. Huh? Right, all done. OK, come on, everyone. Gather around. OK, guys, girls, 
Nobody said these shows would be easy, but as long as we stick together and take this rehearsal seriously, we'll be fine. Trust each other, trust your families at home, and trust the audience, because here at Seaview, they're the best! Remember these key points and you'll be fine. Now let's go out there and enjoy ourselves! Come on! I thought he couldn't see me then. No, it's just that we were rehearsing. I didn't want to stop. Oh, I thought he was going to say he didn't like me. Oh, no, of course not. Have you seen the floor? Yeah. I cleaned it yesterday. It was a right mess. But I like it when it's dirty, because I can get in there and really clean it good. Like that Tracy girl over there. I do like her. Oh, I'd like to stick it in her. Oh, yes. I'd be the mop to her bucket. I'd dry a wet patch any day of the week. Oh, well, I'm sure I'd be interested if you wanted to ask her, Andy. Uh, that bit over there was particularly dirty. I bloody knocked my bucket off as I was trying to clean it last night. Fucking water everywhere. Well, you did a good job, Andy. She left me. Who left you? My missus. They found the bruises. They found the bruises? What, you hit your... I've got a dash to the loo, Andy. Uh, I'm sorry. We'll talk later. Fuck. Hello? Well, what do you mean he's got Jose? No, I'm not coming back out there. Just hide. Uh, got nothing to do with me now. Someone's come in. Gotta go. Sorry. So nice to see you again so soon. Are you happy to see me? Yeah, always happy to see you, Ulrika. Just uh, a lot earlier than last season. Well, I've just realised that if you book at the start of the season, it's a lot cheaper than the middle of the season. And I'm like, OMG, have I just realised that now? <laughs> and it's a lot more quiet than the peak season, so more time for my wing. <laughs> Uh, yeah. I, I think this is about as busy as it's going to get, to be honest with you. <laughs> You're so funny! Stop it! Oh, you just can't stop performing, can you? <laughs> so, are you single yet? Uh, no, still married, hence the ring. <laughs> you know when you've been married too long when you need Vaseline to pull it off uh, for your ring. Uh, your wedding ring. Ah, we'll have to do something about that then, won't we? Actually, I think we might have someone who would be interested in you, Ulrika. He works here, he's right up your street. But I want my weenie. <laughs> Look, I don't want to be a conversation killer, but I've got a bit of a dicky tummy and I, I really need to go again. Is that an innuendo? Huh? No! No, I really need to go again. I can tell when you're lying, your face goes all red, weenie. <laughs> See you later, sexy. See you later, honey. The problems you get from success, eh, hey, Wayne?
see a bloody thing out here. Hey, the fog looks good on camera. No, not the camera. I can't see a bloody thing out here. Barry's gone. Ah, oh, I've got these. Pocket fires. Yeah. You keep pocket fires in your camera bag. No, I don't keep pocket fires in my camera bag. Is when I said I don't keep them in my camera bag. Only today. You know my TV director, producer friend. Yeah. You know the guys that does all the TV work. Yeah. You know, I think I told you, haven't I? Yeah, what the He said, you put pucker pies in your corporate video, they give you like a month's supply of pucker pies. Or even better, a lump sum. Well, if they do that, we should definitely get Jaffa cakes. I like Jaffa cakes, but I especially like them when they're free. Well, if you're getting Jaffa cakes, I want custard creams. You've got pucker pies. Pucker pies isn't my idea, it's my friend's idea. I want custard creams. Jelly snakes. Jelly snakes? What, we're 11? Jelly babies. And hot gloves. Chocolate digestives. We should write this down. Yeah. What about walkers? No, they won't do it. Gary Lineker's a prick. Thanks for leaving me with Andy. Oh, Wayne, he's harmless. His wife doesn't think so. Hmm. Mm. Paul was trying to call on the monitor, but Tracy wouldn't let me answer it. Why? She said he might want us to do something. I don't know how she got a job here. Well, she's infectious, isn't she? <laughs> no, she hasn't got an STI or anything. Hey, I bet she slept with someone. I bet she slept with Paul. Did Tracy do that? Yeah, OK. <laughs> with Paul? <laughs> Dirty bear. Filthy. <laughs> Paul! What do you want? It was a one-time thing, you knew that. Am I going to have to call the police again? Yeah. Didn't think so. Just get over it. I'm not going to tell you again. She was looking at me. She wasn't looking at you, mate. Why was she looking at you? Every time she was looking at you, she was looking at me. Hi, oh, guy. Why'd you believe your own lies? What lies? The fact you thought Tracy was looking at you? I know too well Tracy was looking at me. Why would she be looking at you? I'll tell you why, my friend. Seven inches. Seven inches? The size of your head, mate. Girth. Girth? Right. Slight problem, guy. Why, what have you done? Changed the brief again? The brief hasn't changed. How many times do we have to go over this? Two against one. Oh, Lord. Look, look. Do either of you guys know how to work behind a bar? Do you know what, Paul? It's funny you should say that. We used to work behind the bar at our union back at uni. My so-called barman has decided to pull a sickie on me. So, I'm in need of someone to work the bar tonight. Don't worry, Paul. Leave it with us, and you'll leave it in safe hands, my friend. Now, I'm relying on you two to not let me down. Paul, have we ever let you down? Shh! <laughs> What time do you want us to start tonight? Tonight! Do you think no. we should call an ambulance? Have a great show tonight. It's 
small crowd out there. It doesn't matter, Tracy. It could be their first show or their last, so we have to deliver. Come in, come in, come in, come in. Oh, don't mind these two. I'm in the middle of something. Oh, I'm running a bit late. I had a nightmare shift last night. How am I expected to do a good job without the proper training? Look, I came to talk to you about how bad last night's show went. Well, what happened? Nothing happened, just no one turned up. Can we can we do another take? Oh yeah, 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 sorry, sorry. Yeah, okay. Now, am I holding the Malibu like this? Like that, that. that way, right. <clears throat> At Seaview Holiday Park, we will ensure that you have a good time by the end of your holiday. Paul, can we focus, please? Yes, I'm sorry, sorry, I know. I know, we've got to get the video right. Yeah, OK. <sighs> can we do another take? Yeah. Now, is it good time or great time? It, it is great time, but um, good's fine. Yeah, I'm going to stick with good time. I don't want to be libelled in court. You will end up in court when they're closing this business down for bankruptcy. Can't we do this video another time? I'm not even sure who these guys are anymore. One minute they're media guys, the next minute they're bar guys. Sorry, Wayne. It's not as simple as just pointing the camera in his face and hitting record. Yeah, can we leave it to the professionals, please? Look, I'm seriously concerned about the numbers, but whatever, I'll leave this up to you. See you later. No, wait, 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 please. Please. Now, does it have to be Malibu? Why not? Well, Malibu's a, a drink for homosexuals. Look, I, I'm not homophobic or anything. It's just that I don't like them. Especially the camp ones. Oh, they really get on my tits. I, I don't mean gays that go camping. Well, they, they're perfectly welcome. Unless they think it's some kind of broke back resort, which it most definitely is not. Is that camera rolling? Yeah, that was great. Yeah, just what we're after. I'll give up. 
Don't use that footage! Why are we watching this? Here we go. Pause there a minute. I give up. Can't do everything, you know. I think sometimes I care too much. Well, Paul said he's dealing with it, so just let him get on with it. You can't do everything. You need to lighten up. Let's put Seaview FM on. You always say the right thing. Where's the radio? There. It's a duck. Yeah. Jose broke the real one, so it's the one from the bathroom. Well, how do you... <laughs> one, two, three to the pot. Maggie and Charlie coming straight to your door. Ready to make a promise all back on up. Cos you know I better rip the shit up. Give me the microphone Turn first. Turn the shit off. Like Who's taped over my come down with me? I don't know what you're talking about. Does it matter? It's on every bloody day. You're hardly missing out. Yes, it does, Master Wayne. Someone's taped over the new episodes, not the repeats you're on about. Well, what have they taped over them with? 17 episodes of Family Guy. That might have been me. Can you even understand it? I like the colours. What, are you sure it's gone? Feel free to have a look. <laughs> Oi! I was watching that. Well, even if it has gone, you can watch it again. Oh, will you just shut up, you bitch? Jasmine, you can't say that. Oh, that's it, Wayne. Take her side. I'm not taking sides. Well, you won't when you find out she's deleted your match of the day. What? I didn't mean to. It was an accident. She always has to have her 20% free space on the planner. Wayne, I'm sorry. I can't even look at you right now. Why do you cry? I just don't like Wayne being mad at me. Is that because you love him? No. Why would you say that? We all love Wayne. Not in a sexual way. Yeah, of course. Oh, I can't believe I deleted his match of the day. I know it's his favorite program. It just happened so quickly, I didn't mean to. I'm such an idiot. Jose. No me toques. I'm sorry. Shane Ritchie on Parky. Gone. Too far. Too far. Paris Hilton's British best friend. No, that's the one I'm in. It's been an amazing journey. At the end of every elimination, I say that I have to get back to my life and that I hope one of you will join me one day. And tonight, finally, one of you will be joining me. My new British best friend is... Sam. <gasps> oh, my God. Oh, that is so <laughs> Boy. <laughs> way that Tracy girl likes you. Why not? Because everyone who likes you turns out to be crazy. That's not true. Helen? Don't bring her into it. What was she into? Asphyxiation. And Shaniqua? Sh Shaniqua who? 
Shaniqua Jackson. Ah, oh, doesn't even matter, because at the end of the day, Tracy likes me. Not you, she likes me. If she likes you, how come I banged her behind the bins? You banged her behind the bins? I banged her behind the bins. I don't believe you. Well, what, you want a picture? Yeah, prove it. It's your lucky day here, pal. He's actually taking a picture. He's actually taking a picture. I've got a picture. That's just a picture of you humping a bin. Hey, she's behind the bins. I banged her behind the bins. You banged her behind the bins? I banged her behind the bins. Do I bet you sometimes? Hey, it's my screensaver and I like it. Pathetic. Oh. Hi guys! Oh, this is Chris. Oh God, who's died? No one's died. No one's died? I've just raped her. And you're next. <laughs> God. <laughs> He's a comedian! Wine. Can I have a word? I, I brought Chris in because he wants to do a bit of his stand-up routine for the campsite. OK. Well, let us hear a little bit of your routine then. What, in here? In the toilet of a caravan? If you could, we've got to get the show started. Whenever you're ready. Well, I've got a blinding joke about the visually impaired. Well, go on then. No, that was the visually blinding. Don't worry. Um, see those shot putters at the Paralympics? The only disability they've got is an eating disorder. Why do retards wear Velcro trainers and use Velcro wallets? Uh. We're never taking Viagra again. Last time I took that, I turned into a massive prick. This has been a waste of time. Well, I've never done a gig in a toilet cubicle before. I'm a bit nervous. OK, then. But, you know, perhaps the environment isn't really very helpful. <laughs> I'll let you know. Here you go, mate. Oh, wait, wait. I nearly forgot. You are in charge tonight. I've got to pull off a few extra shifts at Pizza Hut. Well, I thought you only worked there during the off-season. Oh, I do. I do. But, see, they're short-staffed at the moment on account that they've sacked Nigel. Well for something he did at a Christmas party. Apparently, I'm not going to put you into the details, but he was caught molesting uh, <clears throat> reindeer. Oh, well, that's a bit... And a 12-year-old child. <laughs> I don't know how he managed to get him into the suit, or how he got away with it, but... <laughs> Plus, I need some extra money. These theme nights are costing a bomb. Now, you are in charge tonight. It's our first Jamaican theme night. Now, if we get this right, we're all sorted, OK? Wow, I'd be honoured. Thank you. It's only caretaker manager, so don't let it get to your he he head, yeah? <laughs> OK. Now, if you want to get hold of me, you can get me on my phone and 
Here it is. The number right there. Okay. <laughs> See ya. Ladies and gentlemen, live from the Seaview Holiday Camp, it's Jamaican Jim! This is weird intro music for a Jamaican night. playing this all night, they'll go mad. I don't even think it's Jamaican. Oh, this is a disaster. Five pound entry and all they get is him. Look at him. Look at him! Oh, thank God that's over. I wonder what he's going to play next. <coughs> I don't believe it. It's the same song. Oh, we can't have him playing this for three hours. I need to call Paul. Back here, Paul. Sorry, Wayne. No can do. Busy night. Ten chicken wings for a pound. All the pasta for a pound. Uh, this is why you were put in charge, Wayne. This is where you need to shine. Oh. What did he say? He said I was in charge. Let me in. Jasmine kicked me out. Why? She's still furious about Sky Plus. Wow. Can't take much more of this. Why are you still with her then? Her birthday coming up and I haven't had a blowjob in months. Tracy can help me out with that. Look, everyone has their ups and downs. I'm not going to make any rash decisions. It's just not working at the moment. Why don't you make it work? You can start again, Wayne. Do something good with your life. I like my job. I'm not giving up. Shane never gave up. You're not Shane Wayne, you're Wayne. I'm only 35 years old, Jess. I will achieve my goal. I will be a blue coat in Southport. 
just a pipe dream, Wayne. People like us aren't meant to be living up in Southport. that simple. We knew there'd be a lady at home. We knew she used Daz and we knew she'd just done a wash. Bloody thing! What are people talking out to me? And all these fucking things get no signal round here and they're useless. How say? Can I have a word please? Of course. In your office? No, no, no. I can't be asked. Is anyone in here? Sarah came to me this morning. Sarah? Yeah. The receptionist? Yeah. Yeah. Now she told me that you two have been having intercourse. No, no, look. Whatever you do together has got nothing to do with me. So long as it's not in company time, I don't care what you do. So long as it's consensual. Yeah, we don't want the same thing to happen that happened with um, Carlos. Of course. Of course. What is the problem, then? The thing is... She's, um... Oh, <laughs> Fat. No, 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 no. Um, she's... <laughs> Constipated? No, 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 listen, listen, she's, she is, um, oh, 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 yeah. <laughs> Possessed. She, she pregnant. How oh, say? The fucking hell are you guys gonna be long? What? I need to drop the kids off at the pool. What? I need to do a fucking shit. And. <laughs> <laughs> For you, Tracy Hall, see you behind the bins at six. That's CVU FM. Holler!